Welcome back. Today we are going to learn about another important SQL concept which is order by. Now what order by does it is just sorts your data, right? It orders your data in a certain column. So let's take a look at this example again. I'm going to run this command select star from customer. So when I do this, I'm going to get a list of all the customers that are in this table. But as you can see, the names are not ordered. The first is Ada, then there's Alka, there's, there's, there's Faraz, there's Donald. It's not arranged in an alphabetical order. And what if you want to arrange it in an alphabetical order? So what you do is you say, uh, select star from customer, order by, this is the keyword that you use. So SQL knows, okay, you're going to order something. Order by what? So you say order by name, okay? And when I do this, this is going to order all the names. So let's go here and run this. And when I run this, you will see that this is in an ascending order. A, Al Ada and Alka, B, which is Barbara, C, which is Charlene, Christine, D, which is Donald, Faraz, Janet. You'll see that it is getting ordered in an alphabetical manner. Now, order by will always and always sort your data in ascending order or in an alphabetical manner. But what if you want to reverse it? What if you want to arrange it in a descending order? So all you need to do is you specify the name or the column and then you simply type in this keyword called DESE which stands for descending. Okay. So I do this and I click on run and there you go. Now this is in descending order. And that's all there is to order by statement. Order by very simply allows you to sort data. It allows you to sort data in a particular column in an ascending order or in a descending order. So like other videos or like other exercises, make sure that you practice this order by command. You can practice what you just saw or you can completely try a new query, but make sure that you understand the order by concept and you will understand only by practicing. Now I'll see you in the next lecture.